433 WNBC. Why don't we... Uh... Donna Fiducia, but first we have a very important announcement for you to listen to. Listen to this very carefully, please. There is a conspiracy afoot at station WNBC, headed by the Antichrist, John Hayes. General Manager John Hayes wants to undermine the creative integrity of the Howard Stern Show. Do you want the purveyor of sickness and death, John Hayes, to disrupt your favorite radio program? Do you want the demon fiend, John Hayes, to carry out his master plan and vex the Howard Stern Show? Here's Janie LeCue, cleaning woman at WNBC. I was cleaning his office the other night, and in his waste paper basket, there it am, a dead pig with a head cut off, the sign of the devil. All the time he was chanting in there and killing small animals. And I wasn't drinking or nothing. He a pitiable man. He sold his soul to the devil. And now a message for you from a great American who, like Howard Stern, was persecuted by John Hayes. I have a dream. Yeah. That my poor little children... That's right. We'll grow up listening to Howard Stern. I have a dream today. I have a dream that one day down I miss with his vicious racist attitudes with his lips no longer dripping with vodka and one day right there little black boys and black girls yeah. will be able to listen to Howard Stern so I have a dream today yes greatness does recognize greatness are you going to let the dream die as a listener you can help by giving us a larger audience Howard will finally defeat the Lord of the Flies John Hayes you can give Howard the sword to vanquish the son of Satan. Have you ever seen John Hayes with his shoes off? Of course not. He has six toes. Here's John Kennedy. And so, my fellow Americans, ask not what you the Howard Stern Show can do for you. Ask what you can do for the Howard Stern Show.